Okay, everybody, this is Signal Simulator. I just bought it about 10 minutes ago. And what this is, is that you're at a, a SETI Institute, or something like SETI Institute, with these large satellite dishes, and your whole point of being here is to pick up signals, uh, decode them, and for, or signals from space, and hopefully be able to find contacts from uh, extraterrestrials. And let me see, I'm going to take you outside first. Now, I do get stuttering with this game, which is a problem with the latest, w w with Unity-based games now. Not all of them, but some of them. Um, so you'll see some stuttering for some reason. Over there are our uh, solar panels for power. Those are our dishes. Quite a few. And through the daytime, what we're going to be doing, what we have to do is make sure our satellite dishes are properly... Uh, Set, like clean, not set, but cleaned. Now, I'm really not sure what I'm supposed to be doing, actually, but outside of listing the signals and that, but I do know that I have to make sure that the signals here are taken care of, or uh, the uh, solar panels are properly cleaned. You just go up to the box. And we've got a system efficiency, charge efficiency, 79. We're just going to clean it. You do that every morning, as soon as it gets daylight out. There we go, charge efficiency. Of course it's going to go down. Oh, didn't want to do that. Anyway, everything takes power. So let's get back to the... We're just waiting for a signal on top, right? You can tell, you can see where it's at, wait for a signal, so... Now, because I'm getting stuttering with the game itself, because it's a Unity-based engine, my recording is going to be showing stuttering. It's uh, it's really quite wonky. But I, I've been getting that with uh, games lately for, you know, made with the Unity base. Uh, you know, the Unity engine is just insane. I don't know if it's the latest version of Unity that's doing that. But it, it's causing havoc. I don't have any of those issues with Unreal or any other game engine. It's just the new Unity engine. It, it's just insane. I don't know why that is. Anyway, over here, you know, your old computer crap. I was, uh, was going to say crap. Uh, that's the wild signal. But I think it was back in the 70s when they picked that up. UFOs at defense sites told CIA do uh, uh, documents, and of course, get some photos and stuff. And right there is the developer, and he's a really decent guy. Uh, he's really quite something else, um, which sparked me to really start taking a closer look at this. And this is this is actually quite creepy as heck, because you sure get that that feeling. Okay, as I've said, we're waiting for a signal, so we're just going to turn that off. This here, when we do get a signal, or, or somewhat uh, zero in, uh, what we'll end up having to do is get the strongest signal. But this will give us some basic averages of where the signal could possibly be, and it'll narrow it down. Um, now, depending on the strength of your signal and how much data you actually pull from the signal, and if you complete the signal, if it gets decoded, it depends on how much money it, it through that, will determine how much money you actually get, your, your funding sort of thing. And your database is where you picked up any signals, uh, all signals, random signals, story signals. And the story event is really quite interesting and really quite cool. Upgrades, you can uh, you can increase your, uh, uh, you can purchase for your app, your elevation. You got something. Okay. Okay, we got a signal already, signal available, good. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to find the top end of this frequency here. You shouldn't have to really do it like you do, because if you if you get out of range on your signal, it'll kick off. But anyway, you get the idea of that. Alright, this is what we use to actually move our satellite dishes. That's our signal strength. So, let's start tracking this and see what we can do here. Uh, what do 
I do here? Turn that on. Okay, coordinates detected. Okay, so we gotta keep moving this dial until we get a coordinates detected. I believe. Let's do that. My boys ever get creepy in sounds you get. Asimus calculation is 224.469 two, and the average right now is 249. <clears throat> now I know on the side right there you see try with elevation 199 because if this is the first little tutorial that you go through. Uh, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna ignore that. I'm just gonna look at this for now. Because in later signals you don't get any help, so you really have to take a close eye on what's going on. So it's okay. So the average new average is 222. You can watch these numbers and see what the average if you do up the averages yourself. But it's good that we have that. Let's go to terminal. Signal check. That'll give me my averages here for this as well. Sounds like it's raining outside. Oh. Okay, so it's about two. T we'll go two two. Yeah, two two three four. What? Azimuth. Now the right side is. <gasps> Wonder why the textures are off. Hold on for a second here. Textures medium. We'll go high. See if that changes anything. That's really quite weird. There we go. Okay. Clean it up a bit. A bit. Elevation. So that calculation was for azimuth. So it's 220, 226 now. Oh, 230. Okay. Well, ah, jeez. Okay, 224, so we'll go 223 on the side. We're going to go with the side one. we got to move our dishes like now before the signal disappears. This is for the decimal. This one here is 27.42. What's that say? Okay, the averages keep a run. Yeah, the averages are jumping now for the elevation. So we'll go with we'll go with nine. We'll go with 20 and see. Okay, we'll get the dishes rolling. Dishes are now moving. See it? Keep an eye on the signal. We'll just see how it comes up here. That's yeah, gonna be a bit. Holy moly. that. Yeah, we got a long way to go. Okay, we're going to 20. This is hovering around 20. Between 20 and 24? Yeah. 
see how that... 26 now. We're still gonna take a bit. Okay, meanwhile, while we're waiting, you can, like I said, upgrade your systems. Your tech. Upgrade your tech. Uh, which I haven't looked at yet. Um, of course, you have your terminal. Now you do have another world, uh, a room with a server terminal, just as you have here. Okay, so we got set man. Okay, hold on here. Let me see here. Temp check, turbo, power boost, transmission, signal analyze. Enough data. Not there yet. Holy crap, man! Come on, come on, come on! Our is 223, right? The average is 224, so we're we're gonna be almost spot on there for that. But it is a long way to go. Our elevation is 20. That's already been set. We're just waiting for the azimuth to kick in here. And of course you can purchase uh get really close to our, our, uh, our azimuth, it's gonna... I mean, look at the speed here, 0 0.0098. Boy, oh boy, I really have to make money. I really have to make money. Catch as many signals as possible. And the storyline signals, they just, like, the story is in this. Like it's uh, okay. What I mean by that is that you you just don't choose at the main menu to do a storyline and whatever. When you start a game, this is what you're doing, and you'll come across uh, story signals and stuff like that that'll open up and broaden the the, the the story for it. But not all signals are storylines. A lot of them are not probably not storylines, which makes it even better. And I I listened to um, I watched a few videos, and the store or uh, the signal sounds are. Cool. Creepy in hell. And you get pretty excited when you finally do lock onto a signal and able to download it. And of course you have to update your uh, your download speed or your modem and that sort of thing. I, I think you're you're dealing with uh, like a dial up or something. Uh, buffer modules. Download, faster download speed cost of 30. Of course, I have zero credits, so I have to, you know, find these uh, signals. Really? 
this is quite something else. Like I said, it's super, super creepy stuff, man. Where are we at here? Come on. We're almost there. Boy. It's a good thing this signal's sticking around. Okay, we're starting to get our signal. But how strong is it? 40? It's not very strong. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up, one for our, our azimuth, and just... Let's see, if that signal gets stronger. No, it does not. We've lost it. 21. God, this, the motors on this thing are horrible. We were getting a signal there. Okay, we're getting it back. We're losing it. So let's go up one. Okay, we're getting a better signal there now. Stronger signal. Oh, yeah. Download signal data at 100%. Our downloading data size is 470 megabyte. Our download speed is 3.9 megabyte. Oh, geez, it dropped. Okay, let's see if we can't get a stronger signal. All right, so we're going to go with our azimuth, or our elevation. We'll go up one degree with our elevation. Let's see if that strengthens our signal. No. So we'll go down. We'll go down two. Bingo. Oh, no. We'll go down one. So that's going to be pretty much it for that. That's the strength. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to tinker with our azimuth. Let's uh, go up. Woo! Okay. Let's go down one, but we're going to start it and we're going to stop it as soon as we see a good. Oh, come on, Michael. I missed it. Okay, we're going to go down one. Oh, no, hold on. What signal is that? 90%. How much do we have? You hear that sound? Okay, let's see if we can't get this a little bit stronger, maybe. It's a little lower. Signal strength is lower. Nope. Got 93% now. So we'll just keep doing up to the decimals here. Nope. 
91. Okay. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, we got 88. Okay, so we just... Let's pull it down to... We're 97. That's 93, so... We got... Is that 93? Yep. We're at 97%. Do we get a download? Did we lose the signal? Downloading, 83.4. Come on, download this thing. Come on. 86%? 87? I don't know what signal that is because... Um, 90%? That's not... It's a... Uh, I don't know what that could be. But we do have to upgrade our 97. Oh shit, the signal died. Signal. Come on. Okay, it's the coding. There we go. Complete. Right on. We did it. There it is there. So let's play it. And that's the signal. Listen how strong that is. Obviously, I'm gonna have to upgrade my tech, and that's obvious. Uh, so, where's it telling me what I? Oh, shoot! Didn't want to do that. I have 43.59 credits. Now, how much does it cost for some of this stuff? Maximum upgrades of 10. Okay, so that's a cost of 30. What about tracking? Reduces the consumption of electronics. Okay, that's not so much what I'm worried about right now at this moment. Um, antenna detection range increased. Current range 0 0.4, new range 0 0.42. I think that gives me a better range of where I can pull it up signal maybe. Coordinate detection buffer increased. I don't know what to buy, to be honest. I have no idea. What do we have here for this? Whoa, is that another? Oh, it's telling me for a tutorial to go out and clean the solar panels. Okay, well, that's what we'll do, I guess. Now, like I said, you're going to see the stuttering because I, I don't know. Anyway, I'm so upset with the new Unity engine. Uh, it, it, they seem to, you know, every once in a while, whoa. I don't know why in the name. Now this little pumpkin, it said it, it's put in here for Halloween, so at night he follows you around. But there's no reason for me to go out and clean the solar panels yet. But, um... Oh, I did pick up the flashlight. Dang it. I better go back and get that. Increased recharge rate of 90 plus. 
Yeah, no problem. But it's no, there's no point for me to do that. Now, I'm trying to figure out how in the name. Oh, there's a flashlight there. Let's take that. Okay, I'm gonna... Well, since it's nighttime, and we are waiting for a signal to pop in. Uh, that's in the upstairs. Uh, like it's a veranda sort of thing. Where you can overlook. Look for aliens. See if any, any, any aliens come flying through. Uh, which, <laughs> I'm not going to tell you guys what I saw in a video the other day. It was really super cool. Oh, man, it was neat. Alright, let's uh, see what's down in this room here. And there's the uh, the other terminal here. Which I'm not quite sure as to why there would be two. This doesn't make any sense. Because I could sit at the desk and do everything that's showing here. Um, is there like a status as to... Okay, I could do a diagnostic. An error, main server timed out. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna have to retype diagnostic. Okay. Where I saw that error, of course, you had to reboot the server. And that is the problem with old servers, right? The old... I mean, look at the, the, the banks of crap here. Look at this. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not going to tell you guys what I watched in one video. It was absolutely fantastic. Okay, to save on power. Now, is there... You, you turn off switches to save on power and that sort of thing. Um... That was a weird, strange signal, man. Now, I think you could force a signal just by going through here. We're going to turn this off for now. And see if it comes across a signal available. Oh, crap. Yeah, see, it's not even daylight yet. Your charge officially has dropped it. Okay, I gotta get out there. Damn it, sakes. Alright, that's not. Ah, oh, God. Definitely have to get out there. And... Leave me alone, pumpkin. You're freaking me out, man. He's following me. I think, yeah, I think it's down this way. There it is, I think. Hold on. It's down this way somewhere. Where the heck is the solar panels? The satellite dishes, obviously. Oh, there we go. Okay, well, I found it. Yeah, this this little cart here sucked. As far as driving is concerned. All right, let's clean this. We shouldn't have to come out and do this. Not much anyway. But since the tutorial, it's best to do it. go. It will increase the recharge rate of systems with max of uh, 50% when fully upgraded. Uh, the base start of the generator is 25%. It requires fuel, does it? Where do I get fuel from? I don't understand. Where does it get fuel from? Oh, man. I hope developer doesn't make this into a, a grind as far as having to, um, like, I'm working on a signal and all of a sudden systems flail because I don't have any fuel. I mean, that doesn't seem right to me, actually. It's, you know, for fuel for something like that, you would think that the uh, that SETI would have an automatic, you know, delivery of fuel each week. 
you know. But if the server has any error, download and antenna detect system decreases 50%. Errors the download and antenna detection. Okay, we'll be there. Okay, so. Oh, we got a signal. Okay, let's go to my terminal. Again, it's time, dude. That just sucks. Okay. Let's see what this signal's about. Let's just scan the frequencies until we see a little green light show up at coordinates detected. Same, same line here. Okay, since they're starting out around the same range, we're gonna put... Okay, yeah, boy, they're really starting at the same range. Oh, you're kidding me. Okay, we're gonna go 77. is at 80. We'll go at, okay, we'll set that to 80. Right directly on 80, and we'll bring it. And the elevation is at 75, sorry, 77. 75. So we'll go 77 with that, and see. our signal strength and if we see a good we'll see it pop and then we'll just zero in on it It's really exciting when you do finally dip into the signals. You start listening to things. Okay, so we got 79, 78. Okay, the elevation calc. I'm going to put that up to when it gets to 77. I'll. I'll That's all the basics for now, he says, so that's it. I'm on my own. OK, 
Okay. It's down to 75 now. 76. Yeah, see, that's, that's kind of a strange thingy. Yeah, see, the averages are... The azimuth calculation is really hovering between... Like, it jumps, but it's more stable around 77 anyway. Alright, what, what's our... Um, how far away are we on that? gets down to <laughs> kind of a while ago yet man all right um wow that's insane watch those numbers yeah see that Okay, well, apparently I'm going to have to really get an uh, upgrade on my uh, my new rotors and that sort of thing, or upgrade the rotors or whatever. It's almost there. It's, I mean, we're not too far away, but what do we have here for upgrades? Uh, antenna detection is not, but I do want... Both of those actually looked into. How much would it cost? 30 for that. And of course, 30 for that. So, obviously 60. So, maybe if I can get a lock on this signal here, I'll, I will have enough, I hope, in order to um, get those two upgrades. Because th this is what's killing right now is this. This is the speed. And I need to get that going. Okay, we're back up to 80 77. Once it once that hits the 80, I'm gonna pull it back to 77 point. And once the average on this 77, so I I'll, I'll pump that to 77.3. So let's get that ready. And that will be 77. Uh, okay, yeah, I am gonna. Come on. I wonder where our 
numbers here. All right, we're, we're going to stop it here. We're gonna, no, not the video, but we're going to stop this and we're going to recook it here. Come on, give me that signal. Just get the air. We go. We got to bite. What's our strength? Forty-one. Okay, let's see if we can't raise that puppy. Okay, we're losing signal. What's our averages? Seventy-five, eighty-six, seventy-seven, seventy-seven point. Say. There. That's a 78. That's been hit 78 points free a few times there. Maybe if we do a 78 for him. Pull back 78.3. Stop. Redo it. Okay, are we losing our signal now? Definitely what I'm going to be investing in. Faster rotors. We're at 19%. Come on, come on. Do 77 straight. Let's see what our signal gives us. Okay, our signal's coming up. Stronger, stronger, stronger. No. Uh, Michael, wrong knob, dude. Okay, no, no, no. Okay, we're going to work on this one. Okay, what's our averages here? 76? Okay, we're going to, let's go down to 70. Let's go 76. And we'll go with decimals of, like, zero straight here. Let me see if that gives me a stronger signal. Come on, come on. Gives me nothing. 72. Okay, let's go increment of one now. Still no loss of signal. Huh. weird. Okay, that is definitely not going to happen. Yeah. Go 76. One more time. Okay, it seems to... Okay, 
Okay. Okay, we got 46. All right, let's start working on this. What do we got here? 75. All right. It's really quite odd. I'm not losing signal strength, which is really quite bizarre. Zero. Okay. Seventy-seven. signal hose too long. <sighs> that sucks. That purely sucks, man. Uh, damn, if I just had more time, I'd be able to narrow it down, but that must have been a really weak signal. Seriously, that had to be a weak, barely weak signal. But then again, I was taking too long. But then again, too, it took too long for this. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to upgrade. Now, that's what took the most time was for me to... What was it I wanted? Modules. Something, no, that's not what I wanted. Upgrades. It could have also been... Um, now, the, the azimuth is what has been needing to be changed a lot more. Like, the, the ranges seem to be further off, so what we're going to do is we're going to purchase that. Okay. Apply. Back. This coach oh, didn't want to do that. I want to see what our servers... Maybe our servers went down, too. I mean, who knows, right? Ah, that could have been what caused it. I don't know. No, we lost that signal. Alright, folks. Well, tutorial went well enough. <laughs> okay, my next video is gonna, gonna be me... I don't know. Who knows? Maybe I'll pick one up. Maybe I won't. Hey, who knows? Bye for now. Oh, before I go, let's just listen to that, la that first wave we picked up. Code it. Got a couple of coin off of it, but uh, there's another. All right, everybody. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this video. Take care. Believe me, this game gets much more creepier.